last show in Bournemouth is tonight. Yeah. Yeah. You know, the most um, I've heard is one of my songs called Ready to Fall yeah. and What If. Those are the two that, and then I've got, you know, some fun, um, just fun little kind of country songs that people really love. Uh, another is called Single Tonight. But the one that that touches everyone's heart would probably be What If or um, Ready to Fall. Of those two songs, which is the most personal for you? Oh, that's a tough one. Um, it's probably What If. Uh, Ready to Fall is pretty personal, but What If would have to be the most personal that I've I've been in my songwriting. Oh, yeah, of course. I mean, when when you can show the emotion of the song, of what you felt when you were writing that song, it automatically connects to the audience. And at the end of the day, everyone goes through the same emotions and feelings of, you know, wondering what what to do, what if, how does he feel, how does she feel, things like that. And that is something that I think everybody can connect to at some point in their life. Mm -hmm. Well, I've been at this for quite some time. Um, for the, the last six or seven years, I've been working on this, but um, really, really focusing on this new EP and the last album over the last two years. So doing tours and things like that has definitely been um, about over the last two years. Um, honestly, I would say this this new EP, mm -hmm. to be completely honest with you, um, it has been the most open and honest that I've ever been in through what I was going through at the time that I'm so proud of of that music and what I was able to create. The strongest emotion, um, mm. I mean, I think it would be joy and happiness, mm. you know, just, just pure joy to, to be able to take something from a thought and an idea to this, these beautiful, amazing songs. Mm. You're touring with Boyzo. Yes. Which is pretty big. Yeah, yeah, a little bit. If you could have your dream career from now onwards, what would it be? I mean, my dream career mm. would be, of course, to um, go all over the world and perform and sing and, uh, you know, have a career like, you know, Celine Dion or something like that. You know, I think that would be amazing. But for me, if I could do this for the rest of my life, and just sing for people and make music and perform. You know, I don't need all the fame and wealth in the world. I, I just want to be able to do what I love. And as long as I can continue to do that, that's all I need. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you.